Hello everyone, James Martinez, how are you? If you're visiting my website, I'm sure you're very aware that I am an artist and an author and many other things. Uh, God blessed me with uh, some amazing talents and I've been sharing them with everyone for a while now. Uh, when I first started out, when he first blessed me, I wanted to help as many people as I can. I, I still feel that way, but I simply gave away everything that he was giving given me for free and I wanted to just be a blessing in people's lives so whatever they were in need of for a, a long time for a number of years in fact I, I still do it I simply want to help people wherever they are and whatever it is that they're struggling through uh, different things for different people and it's an opportunity also to connect with them and be a part of something that God has in store for them so I really feel like uh, you know being able to serve and help people with the abilities that he's given me really goes a long way in giving my life fulfillment. So it's one of the things that I enjoy doing. Uh, another thing though, though, that's coming through with, with what we're doing here is are the books, the literature. Uh, so far we've written Once in Poem, A Transcendent Realm, and Eternus Sperary, and we've published both of those already. Uh, if you've not read them, uh, I invite you to have a, a read. Uh, they're, they're pretty amazing books. There's a lot, a lot of insight inside of them. There's quite a bit of uh, perspective and a lot of telltales that all add up to some extraordinary things that I have become a part of with God. Uh, I've read the Bible many times since becoming friends with God. And in the process, I realized that all the things that I have become a part of were spoken of directly within the Holy Bible. I think some people are challenged whenever you know they, they hear messages that are coming from God or that someone like myself is having interactions with God and we're doing fantastic things that is beyond their understanding. I, I think there's a lot of skepticism and doubt and a lot of naysayers out there already. Uh, people struggle with their faith. You know, it's no secret. We see it all the time. But to have something so fantastic as this coming from the Holy Trinity it really speaks volumes about what God does for people in this world. Uh, he's been doing it for a long time. You know, I'm not the only person he's ever worked with or that he's uh, blessed or saved or, you know, lifted up in, in his own ways. You know, he has chosen people and anointed people throughout the ages. And he has specific plans for people's lives. Whether they want to admit that or not, we all have a type of destiny and predestination that we live out within our lives you know we do have say in what we do and some people you know they deny god uh at the same time some people want to make their own choices in life and don't live up to their potential but ultimately we are all destined to do something in our lives and how we go about doing the things that we are met with and, and how we choose within those experiences is something we're all gonna have to answer for one day you know, uh, Judgment Day is real, is, is true. Uh, again, talking about these books and the experiences that I have been, become a part of, they are so fantastic that they have literally changed the course of history. And we're talking about some supernatural, extraordinary things here. We have literally changed history. And in the process of delivering this book, um, made history. So it's pretty fantastic. The challenge though, to bring a message like this to life is, is quite difficult at times. The world is a very challenging place. I'm sure you guys are very well aware of that. Uh, but having face-to-face -face encounters with the Holy Trinity, I have seen the Holy Spirit. I have seen and walked with Jesus and I have seen and walked with Father God. Uh, I think some people struggle with that, but God, and just like angels, right, can reveal themselves to whomever they choose. And God chose me. And uh, if you're unfamiliar with that, he's above absolutely everyone and everything. Above all the angels, above every person, above every creature, every creation, everything, everywhere. That person. I got to become friends with him. And I have since become friends with him. And we've been doing some pretty fantastic things over the years. So I do invite you to have a read. He gave me the very first line and the last line of Once Upon a Transcendent Realm before we started. And he said, here, write this down. And then we went out and started doing all these things. And afterwards, 
He said, okay, now I want you to go and write about all this stuff. And that's what we've been delivering over the years now. And it has been an amazing journey and you are invited to it. So if you're getting anything from this website or from the post or anything online, social media, anything like that, I invite you to investigate a little further. There's so many wonderful things that are coming through and all of this is thanks to Jesus. So I give it up to him every day. I thank our Father in heaven for him every day. God bless you, Jesus. And I hope that this is a blessing your life. God bless you guys. Thanks for visiting.